get into that, we're going to catch up with some of our stars on the South African Rally Championships, Leroy Poulter and Mark Cronier. You know, we've worked together and we've been friends for a long time. We've, we've, we've been away and, and it's just it shows that we've, we've brought it into racing and we've been competitive through our lives really from the age of eight years old and right the way through now and we're still battling against each other. started off with, uh, as a very young age, nagging my dad to literally go and watch uh, some karting and um, my dad eventually buckled at the knees and we got involved with a little bit of indoor karting initially and uh, before we knew it we, we both had two junior GP carts and off we went to Swartkops for the first time. I started on two wheels um, with my family, um, been in racing for many years, uh, obviously wanted, to, wanted me to get involved. We won three uh, national championships with the bikes and in the fourth year I was um, doing really well and fell and broke my knee quite badly and uh, my mother stopped everything then, then and then and said to me, you better do something safer. And we started off at karting. I did uh, the world finals uh, four times before actually winning it. Gavin won it in the first year, which was quite an achievement. It was an inspiration for me to look up to. And um, the best part of it was I won the South African round, which I couldn't have asked for anything better. I mean, I, I still won't forget those feelings, you know, driving around that circuit. I could literally hear the people on the last lap, you know, going ballistic. And then I went and did in 2008 at uh, in Italy La Conca circuit. That's where we've, we've both won. And I think, you know, I think both guys winning, it just shows that, uh, you know, I think once you've won in a car, you can win in anything else. I was very fortunate um, at that stage already to have Toyota on board. Um, they decided to put me into Group N racing. Um, a very small class I started in class F. Again, going up against Leroy, Leroy was sponsored by uh, the Opel um, brand at that stage. There was a, a stepping stone to, to move up through the ladder, which the manufacturer supported us. And it just showed from Carty, nothing changed. We both were at each other in, in class F, which was, I think I was 16 then, and, and he was probably 17, which both we were young and, and trying to learn the ways around it. We were both very close and competitive. They gave me an opportunity to go off-road racing, I think Leroy carried on production cars at that stage and the off-road really worked well for me. I think uh, it suited me more than any of the other sort of driving styles and um, in my first year I finished I think second overall. I almost won the overall championship in a class E bucky. It shook the off-road fraternity so hard that they literally changed the rules in that year. I moved in onto to off-road racing from there with, uh, with Nissan. Um, and it showed it was really good. I, I won, I think it was four year, races that year and had a lot of, uh, a lot of incidents, but we, I think the experience gained was, was what we needed to for rallying. This is where we are today. You know, we, we started out, first of all, in A6, which we won literally every race, and then A7, again, winning everything in that front. And then I got the opportunity to drive alongside Surge just for one or two races in the S2000. And, um, Right from the outset, I think uh, we showed that we were going to be a force to, to be reckoned with. Then we moved to the, the bigger class this year, and you know, Mark is there again, and, and it just shows each rally we, we're on each other's uh, case all the time. Um, you know, he's had a really good season up until now, and um, he's been there a little bit longer than me, but we've, we've learned a lot, and I think into the future we'll. We'll be there with him. Absolutely, we're going to go hammer and tongs. I think it's. Uh, I think we we built for each other, so we're going to be batting heads all the way through our career.